Good afternoon, old traders. It is October 30th at just before 3 p.m. Eastern time here on the East Coast, and uh, we've got just over an hour left in trading, but I think, I suspect that uh, we're pretty much done for the day. Uh, we went as high as uh, 54.45. We went as low as 53.83, I think. Um, yeah, 53.83. And we're settling somewhere in the middle at uh, 54.12, as you can see on the chart right now. Um, none of my plans really panned out today. Um, I was a little too greedy with my short buy order this morning, and I set it at 53.50, thinking that, that we would make a push. I would have bought at uh, the high at 54.45, of course. That's good enough, but uh, we only touched there once and dropped soon thereafter, so I never got a chance to even think about it. Um, when we did drop and uh, we fell below 54, I started to look at buying a long hedge position. Um, if we got to somewhere around the day's lows, um, which were around 53.75, but uh, that didn't happen either. <laughs> and uh, we only touched, at, like I said, at 53.83 and then climbed back up to where we are now. So yeah, just more waiting for now. Really not much else to say. Um, kind of have to wait and see what the bull and the bear fight um, results in. Maybe tomorrow, most likely, if not tomorrow, then Wednesday when we get news. Um, API tomorrow after the close and EIA on Wednesday morning at 10.30 a.m. Eastern Time. One or the other or both will definitely move us in one direction or the other. <laughs> um, yeah, it would be nice to get into a long hedge position to protect myself against further upside, um, but I do need to have a good pullback in order to create that opportunity. Um, the, uh, the lows, really, I, it would be an aggressive play for me to get in at 53.75 or so. It would be a, a small long nonetheless, but still something, and, uh, but I'd like to see somewhere closer to 53 between you and me. Um, were you guys able to play this action today? Did you make the calls right? Let me know in the comments down below or over on tradingjournal.ca where you can find more information on my portfolio, trades, results, performance, etc, etc. In the meantime, give us a thumbs up, subscribe to stay tuned, and I'll check back with you guys ahead of trading tomorrow at 9.30 a.m. Eastern Time. Until then, good luck. Cheers.